Yo, guys, what is up? It's Teach here, coming at you again with another Dino A Day review series, and we are on to the Plesiosaur. Now, this thing is probably the most useless water tame, if we're being totally honest. About all it's got going for it is raw speed. Other than that, it's it's smaller than a Mosasaur, so it's not quite as useful. It doesn't do as much damage. It doesn't have a high health stat. It's just fast. So... I know this thing is, is getting a little bit upset with me saying these things, but you can see, I'll give it some XP here. And show you what this thing is capable of. So, its health goes up pretty decently. Nothing extraordinary. Um, stamina is pretty high base on this thing. Melee damage, it's not super effective, so I personally don't choose to use that on these things. However, when it comes to scouting and moving around the server crank up this thing's movement speed and you will have yourself one heck of a time moving around. There isn't really anything that can keep up with this bad boy. Um, he does have a really fast attack like you see here, but it's nothing that's like extraordinary in any way, shape, or form. Um, you can kind of attack from an angle because of the fact that he is a large creature like you see right here, but it's nothing, again, that's like, oh my goodness, this is something I have to have in my life. He doesn't even gather that much raw fish meat from something that provides hundreds, quite literally. Um, so that's something that's kind of frustrating. He does heal pretty well with raw fish meat. Um, he goes up about, I think it's like three or five per one he eats, give or take. Let's see here, 54 to 57, so it is three. Um, so you can heal him up pretty quick because he does have that ability to move quickly. But... Overall, not the most useful. He does have a saddle. Um, there are two types of saddle for the Plesiosaur. He's got a platform saddle and he's got a Plesiosaur regular saddle. Now the platform saddle is by far the most useful. Useful. Uh, and that is because you can place things on its back. You can place turrets, not actual turrets, but like rocket turrets and uh, mini gun turrets. And you can pretty much shred any boat in the water by chasing him with this thing. But other than that, again, kind of useless uh so i'll show you right now what i'm meaning by this he is incredibly fast his bite is quick but not like the most damaging of sea creatures doesn't have a high health stat but when it comes to speed this thing is on a different level as you can see <laughs> this thing can cruise through the water i cannot think of something in arc underwater that will keep up with this thing because it just hauls now Fun fact, this is a, a Lyplerodon. All right, it's very similar to the Lyplerodon, um, the Plesiosaur, and this is actually arguably larger than the Mosasaurus. Um, that's just, you know, science. There's a lot of people that kind of argue this. There's like a species X underwater dinosaur uh, that they found, and they think it's a Plesiosaur, and that thing was monstrous. So the, realistic, the, the realisticness of this thing being so much smaller than the Mosasaurus is a little bit far-fetched but unfortunately it's basically useless other than a scouting tame and a speed tame for under the water again it doesn't have high enough health doesn't have high enough damage doesn't have the ability to grab things like a tuso doesn't have the ability to have a tech saddle like an uh, a megalodon or a mosasaurus uh and it doesn't give you the special perks that a lyplerodon gives you so it's just a tame it's kind of like oh well i guess it exists but that's about it so this guy, not really useful except for just getting you places quickly on the map. Um, you can cruise across the map in the water pretty fast, and it's probably, in my opinion, faster than any tame on land that I can think of, other than maybe like a souped-up Gallimimus. So you can cruise. I don't think that a wyvern would be able to keep up with you, or even a pteranodon. So, kind of unique. So, it's probably one of the fastest mounts in the game, in my opinion. But that's about its only special ability. So, really quick video this time for today, guys. I know, I just, I gotta try and give an honest review of it, and it's not my favorite creature. That's the honest answer. So, anyways, hope this video helps you out, and uh, if you've never tamed one of these things, they're, they're super easy to kill in the wild, because they have such a huge turn radius. But when they're tamed, about all they can do is absolutely haul butt. Alright, hope this video helped you out, and teach out.